Hello guys, welcome to Jimble Shave. I haven't been on for a while, I've been really, really, really busy. Uh, those who follow me on Facebook will know I've been on a, like a, a tour, a road trip. I've been into Rome, Florence, all over Northern Italy, Tuscany, back nine hours off, back out on another job. And I currently find myself in the city of Liverpool. Yes, I'm back in the UK, back in my own country. Hotel, bit of a shit all if I'm honest. It's, uh, it's actually the Adelphi Hotel in Liverpool. Got people around Liverpool. Well, know the Adelphi Hotel, they know its reputation, and it's not known for class. But uh, in, back in the day, it was back in the day, there, there were some greats used to stay here. Uh, Frank Sinatra, he, he was a regular to this hotel. Uh, quite a few, few of the real big names that I can't remember. Right, what are we doing today? The Henson. This is the uh, Henson Plus Plus, aluminium construction and steel blue, steel blue in colour. Let's take that apart, and you'll see there, you'll see the plus plus sign. I mean, I think that means that's uh, medium to mid aggression, so it's not the uh, most mild of the uh, Henson shavers, it's the plus plus. I like it. There's the base plate, top cap, nice electric, well, steel blue in there on its first use. I'm going to be using a Gillette Wilkinson Sword Saloon from India. Not the German ones, the saloon ones. And here is the blade. Wilkinson Sword Saloon pack. Tell you what, I know it's hot everywhere at the moment, but in this particular bathroom I'm in, there's a dirty great old-fashioned radiator beside me. And it's blasting out the heat and I can't turn the heat off. It's so uncomfortable just being in here. It's really, it's really unpleasant. Okay, so for today, thanks to Sean Arter, sent me the sample, 11, Sicilian lemon. You see that? Yeah, 11, Sicilian lemon. That's the soap sample for today, and I've lowered it up in my Chinese soup bowl, and there we have it there. There it is on the brush. Now, extremely lightly scented, I find. Uh, I'm only picking up a hint of lemon. Very, very mildly scented. I don't think I've used an eleven soap before, so thank you, Sean. It will be good to see how we crack on with that. Okay. Razor blade. Top of the top cap. Whew. God, it's so hot. Uh, this hotel would have been such an old hotel too. There's uh, no air conditioning. Yeah, in this day and age. That just shows you the class of hotel that I'm in, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, that's how much blade show we have there. Not a lot at all, not a lot at all. Should be a safe razor. I find the Gillette Wilkinson Sword uh, Indian saloon pack, I find them to be quite mild, quite mild. So we see how we'll get on with this razor. The uh, splash for today will be the blue, uh, Brute, merely because it matches the blue theme. I've got uh, blue in the brush, blue razor, so blue brute, oceans, brute oceans. Okay, let's crack on, shall we? Wet the whiskers. Yeah, so even just finding time to shave recently has been uh, tricky for me. And I have to admit, I have cheated a couple of times. Because as you know, I used a leaf to do the dome. And on two occasions over the past week, I've just thought, ah, sorry, I've lowered up the face as well. I've used a leaf, I've done that. I've used a leaf on the face, yeah. Now, I was asked that question not long ago. Feels nice. The soap is actually cooling me. I wish I did have a menthol soap with me at the moment, to tell you the truth. Yeah, I was asked that question. Have I ever face shaved with my leaf? And at that point, I hadn't. And I said, watch this space. 
Colin, you're right, there's no like brushing the lava on it. It's so soothing, it really is. And now I know I can get a, a good facial shave from the leaf quite easily without the need of any other razor, any other DE to help me with touch ups. So uh, I will be doing a video of that in the very near future. Just it's been so hard to uh, put things together recently. One of those plugs, the water drains away. Yeah. Okay. Let's get in. Let's get this bristle off, guys. And I want to, just want to dive in a shower later. You see the angle on the head? Just hold that handle flat to the face, and you're in business. Now, I don't think this blade is very good. With this razor. I just get that initial feeling. I do like this razor, but I do find that the sweet spot's very, very narrow. And I can certainly tell that this isn't the sharpest of these. It's a nice, mellow, smooth blade, and a lot of guys do love them. Ken Surf's, for one. But definitely not the sharpest tool in the box, I find. Although, shaving this side of the face, with my right hand. Seems to be easier than shaving this side. Wait, hey, I do believe we've got a little tiny wee bit here. Another decap to spot. Yeah, so I've done some miles uh, on the old road. Actually, uh, made a little protest. I thought it was a bit shitty. Do I work with sheep? They're uh, treating me at one point. Oh, 1,000 mile drive. And they want me straight back out. Okay, they're busy. The fact that they're short-staffed, is that my fault? No, it's not. Why should I suffer? It's obviously down to mismanagement, isn't it? If they weren't so bad, they wouldn't have a shortage of staff. But it all comes down to that horrible word, don't it, that bosses like to use? Teamwork, teamwork, yeah. Absolute load of balls come on be a member of the team teamwork what the boss is actually saying is hey pull me out of shit here bust your ass for me break your back pull me out of shit that's what they're saying that's your teamwork for you there'll always be some there'll always be a, a colleague there Willing as well, won't I? And if you don't partake in the teamwork, it makes you look bad, doesn't it? Yeah. Teamwork. Yep. Welcome to the team, guys. Be part of the team. I mean. Okay, to a point. Main part of the team, yeah. But you really don't want to be treated as a mug, do you? Can't let them mug you off.
Nobody thinks any better of you. Yes, the last couple of days have been quite easy, really. Very short drive, Liverpool, from uh, East Yorkshire. Just two nights here, thankfully, in this uh, dreadful hotel. Don't you, you guys in the UK, don't have you ever seen a... Uh, Used to be a programme on TV years ago called Hotel. My manageress was a vampire woman called uh, Irene or Eileen. Eileen. And she thought she was something special. She would just shout and scream at everybody. Guests were bringing their own pizzas and she was shouting and screaming at coach drivers, bus drivers, saying they were doing things wrong and dropping it off too early. All that nasty piece of work who had ideas about the station and she thought she was somebody just because the TV cameras were following her. Well, this is that hotel. This is that. So they're going for me cheese here. Just on a slickness. There we go. Well, that's why I do that. Well, it's feel around for the Velcro. Once the lava's off, it's easier to feel the Velcro. Just give it a light touch. On the residual slickness, then I know I don't, don't have to do a lot of buffing and stuff. And I'm actually shaving the lava off. Right. Just enough lava. From ensemble show and cracking stuff. How did you know we'll get three passes out of that? Very nice. And I've still got lots of samples to uh, use it from Chuck Shaving Channel. Some very generous viewers. Not the easiest of shaves. But I'm getting there. The uh, Wilkins sword was trying to work. <laughs> I just happened to give it a little bit more. Welly. It's really struggling against those uh, riding the cap against the uh, cheeks there. Yeah, I'm finding the uh, sweet spot narrower than I normally do. Surely that can't be down to the blade. Missing a load. I was worried about it against the grain under the nose, but no, it's been fine. Did the business. No problem whatsoever. Yes, I'm away home tomorrow. Just got out the yeah, bedroom window open there. I'm just going to line it up with the bed and just hope for the best. Hope I can sleep. No, I'm not whinging or complaining about the glorious weather. 
Well, I've got here at the moment. Just think it's so bad that an hotel hasn't got aircon installed. But I did once go to uh, a hotel in Cyprus, and you really would expect the air conditioning there, wouldn't you? No. High to season, no air conditioning. Cyprus. It was murder. I ended up hiring a car. <laughs> with air conditioning and it was actually a joy to get into this car with the air con on yeah I'll sleep in the car <laughs> and the blade's just skipping over the neck there I can't feel the blade whatsoever but it's BBS the neck go over the rinse Cold rinse, I really need a cold rinse. Does the old pipe work in this hotel? It takes a while for the cold water to actually get through the tap. I mean, most of the hotels in the country, this, apparently. Let's towel off. I was thinking of a, a head shave this evening, but uh, I'll wait. I'll wait until when they're cooler conditions. Let's towel, red hot. That's what it is. It's, it's a big, massive, old-fashioned tower rail down here. Poche feel. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, so the Henson with the uh, Wilkinson Sword Saloon blade. The Indian blade. Thought it was going to struggle more than it did. I did struggle a little bit against the grain on the cheeks, riding the cap to get the uh, cheeks BBS. But I got there, it is completely BBS. It's very nice actually. Excellent feel. That lovely BBS waxy feel when you've had a good good shave. Well there. Uh, okay, so that was the race today. The Henson Plus Plus in Stone Blue. Brush for today was Deers Cosmetics, a brush I've called my Flanders brush, my remembrance brush. So for today. Can be sent from uh, by Sean Arter from Canada, and that is 11 Sicilian lime. So it performed very, very well. It was only a small sample. There was enough to get three passes out of it. It was slick. I just didn't find a smell of lemons. It's, uh, it wasn't a great scent to it at all. It was very, very mild, but a very good soap. And I do believe it's the first time I've ever used a lemon. So yeah, of course that was all whipped up in my uh, Chinese soup bowl. And let's go on for the splash. Let's go on with the splash. Let's see if we get a burn. If we do, I don't think it'll be much of a burn. How wrong was I? That's a fair old sting on my neck. That's that's because it's a buff so much. Yeah. Lovely. Brute oceans. It's a nice fresh after after shave splash that guys. If you ever see any supermarkets when you're uh, out and about on your travels. Okay, uh, thanks very much for watching. Uh, if you're on this occasion, I've just passed 1,500 subscriptions. Uh, it's actually 1,502 last time I checked. So I'm just over there. So I'm gonna wait off a little bit before doing a giveaway because you can hit these landmarks, do, do the giveaway. And before you know it, you've lost two subscriptions you've dropped beyond the uh, goal post and you got to do it all again so yeah that'll come in the near future a giveaway so thanks for all you uh, new subscribers old subscribers existing subscribers everybody thanks for getting me over 1500 it's much appreciated right you all stay safe now i'll see you all further down the line guys bye, -bye.